Okay, give me a second. And there we go. Oh, Jesus. Looks like. Hold on. Love it all the way. Ba, 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 ba. There we go. Okay. Now we're good to go. Alright, so where are we? We are in the land of the dead. Can't carry more items. Oh, this is the boss fight, isn't it? No, wrong way. That's what we were for. This is where we need to go next. I think we're gonna die. We made it. Yes. Yes, the moon is not set yet. The Satan Sphere is still safe. Not as long as we're around, anyway. It means Shauna's still safe. Once you go up this road of souls, there will be no return. Uh, are we climbing up? showed us the way. I hate. I have no hesitation. Let's go. Okay, we're all gonna go die now. Sphere is the last barrier to protect the world. If it is destroyed, there will be no other way but to deal with the god itself. When China crosses to the moon that never sets, the god of destruction will be born. I'll let up. I'll finish it here. Okay. I think so too. And there's Dad. Or at least affects me that I have. I'll finish the world here. Reveal yourself. <laughs> yeah, right. I didn't hide. Our settlement is a peaceful one. We don't need weapons. A fight is not appropriate before the celebration of a birth. I won't let you. Don't come near me. And he gets his butt whooped. Well then, I won't let you. has already been released to the final the finale of the world the moon's following 
about that. The world is ending. Does that mean that humans can't evoke the will of the creator? That's a good question. Not yet. Don't give up. It's just the signet of the moon is broken. Yes. <laughs> we can still struggle. The moon has not obtained Shana yet. Or so or you, you think, anyway. Let's pursue Zeke. Just because you didn't see her leave doesn't mean that she's not already there. This is a dead end. No. Wings of Savan. Yes, yeah, so everybody get on. Take us to the moon. Sure. A little manta ray can fly that high. There we go, here's our cinematic. That's supposed to be the tree of life. Here comes the moon to land on the tree. As the last act. They actually put vocalizations on this video. They didn't any of the others. Those are nasty looking demons. Species 108. Talked a little bit when you first met him. Uh, everything is turning out just as he wished. The seal of the moon was broken, and a terrible, disastrous plan laid by Soa finally has started. Those Rajas are a mere advance card 
for the pr primary Raj embryo. It seems the birth of the god of destruction will only be a matter of time. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, does the divine tree which gave birth to all the, the species want this as well? It's a good question. Well, it's not over yet. We can still fight to save it, can we? Uh-huh. After you've seen those, you still can say that? Let's go. The moon that never sets is waiting for us. So, we'll save. It's a lot of story, too. And we'll save on two. And what we'll do is at this point, we'll save on two and three. We're not going to use one. That way, if we have to, for a reason, go back for level grinding or for item swap outs. You know, because, frankly, I'm full of items, but I don't know if everything that we have is actually going to be useful. So, well, I know what we have is completely worthless. I we need different um, potions or whatever. We'll see. Ooh, look. What's this? It's fruit from the of the divine tree. It seems to be dried up though. Fruit. Did all the species really arise from such a small thing? Only the creator Soa knows that. So it's just a legend for us. But we are standing on the divine tree which supposedly was in the same legend. We'd better believe it. I guess so. Let's move on. We better hurry up there or, or there will be uh, no one to tell the legend. Okay. Alright, so our first fight, how nasty this is going to be, and how far garbage are we? Man, of course. Well, they're pretty cool looking. I can't hit my QTEs today, apparently. Oh wow, that did like no damage. She did like no damage. That is horrible. Um, disparate. Really? I missed. Really? Disparate?
she generates uh, SP the fastest, so I'm not worried about it. Oh, that was painful. Give me rainbow breath. Because she can get to full uh, SP in what? Four turns? So it's not really a big deal for her to use her uh, Dragoon. The other two take like six to six to eight turns. Because their, their generation is so slow. But it's okay. So we know that they will do desperate here. But desperate isn't really a um, problem to deal with. experience points. That's like the most experience we've ever seen out of a fight. It's pretty wild. I don't know if we're going to be good on levels though. To be honest, I really don't know. Oh, hold on. What's this one? I think this fruit was shed by some kind of fish. One of the fruits are risen from the divine tree? Really? Yes, it was the same for us humans. The god of destruction will start the same way, did he? Did? Yes, let's move on. Or did it? It's a very good question. Yeah, if the god of destruction really is the same as everybody else. Or if it's an external force that's trying to usurp the trite. So that's a possibility too. Oh, oh! Okay. Um. <laughs> oh, I missed. Uh, yeah, I need to get rid of him. Oh, that's horrible. Ow. I think Maroon might just have to... Guard. She's on guard for the next few rounds. Because I really don't want to have to spend time with her. Um, in her dragoon state. Oh no, charm. Really? Fine. Make a red charm. It really is the best way to get rid of it. I swear. This is always a rough thing. Uh, 
that to get rid of his charm too, so. See, that's not too bad, it's that. Monkey the hits hard. It's a cute cat. Oh, I missed. Five rounds. Sometimes you only need it for one round or two rounds. Yes. Damn, you don't always need it for the full length of the spell. So it's like joys. But it's okay. It served its purpose. It healed everybody back up. What the? <laughs> what? Um. What? Good evening, Leafer. This area is the last area, and it's supposed to be tough. Are you seriously kidding me? No kidding! I mean, the experience is fantastic, but... Oh my goodness. I've already had the... Yes, you missed the moon drop. It actually happened, like, literally a few minutes ago. The stream, it seems like it is sending a vital force to the moon. That never sets. Yeah, I started a little early today because I want to make sure we had enough time because I thought I was going into a boss fight. I didn't realize we were going straight to the moon. So. Yeah, you missed the conversation with uh, Daddy Dearest blowing up the stuff. Died in me too. <laughs> um, then if we take the stream, then the other thing is over there. That's right. I don't know if I want to willingly, um, do that. Notice how Kongle's never around. They always forget he exists. Everybody else is here. Where's Kongle? Poor Gigantos is never on screen, I swear. Oh, yes. <laughs> I did show him. Uh, we got right up close. Yeah, no kidding. In addition, maybe because we let ourselves uh, flew in the vial force. I feel revitalized. Uh, it means that the true power, that the power of the divine tree that gave us birth to all species is alive. Mm hmm? This is true. 
Yeah, I know. Waiting for Congo just to fall on top of everybody else. There's Maru. Silver dragon armor. The white silver dragon armor. So, what's that do for us? Which is probably. Oh, it's white silver, so it's gonna be the lady we never use. So you may finish the game in two more Saturdays? That's kind of the hope! So the kind of the hope is, you know, two or three more days. Depending on how much story we have. Alright, so that's a rest point. Now we just need a save point. So where's our save point? Uh, this is one of the fruits too. Yes, and all the species uh, were born in this way are about to be annihilated. Rose. Let's get going. The thing is, is that the... Oh, it's really not much, but level oh, you're still... I think so, too. Honestly, I think I am low, too. Especially after that monkey fight. That might have to show that we are definitely not where we need to be for level wise. So I'm beginning to think that at this point, it might not be a bad idea to find the um, the checkpoint and do a little grinding. Ready for rain. That was painful. That was definitely on the painful sides. we're taking right now is just really high. So I'm firmly believing that 
today's probably gonna be a grinding guy. I'm gonna go from here, find the next, um, checkpoint. And then, um, kind of bounce between them. Because, like, the only one that's level 35 is Dark. I built this 30, right. And... This piece seems really low. Level wise. Cause we're gonna hit really hard. Be next to the save point too. Speaking of save point, so even without the shop, this is. a really great place to, to grind if you're grinding because it's not a long trek from here to the um, hill point and back so it's really not that bad if from here to the, the, the uh, hill point and back there's only what two screens so that's actually a really good place to grind Not that you really need it for these guys. And they hit kind of hard, but... It's not, you know, detrimental. You can heal through it. You just have to be kind of careful with it. problem those rows. I mean she just does not have the endurance. I'm gonna have to give her that hit point ring again. Um he's blind. Well, I can get rid of it but It's such a waste to her, Dragoon. Or a waste of his. And I could use his Dragoon. Da, 
gotta heal, gotta heal, gotta heal. Oh, looks like I finally broke. Thank you. Wow, that was horrible. Me and QTEs not having a good day today. Kill that stupid worm. And we can take care of the rest of it. Easy peasy. There we go. I just have the one frog. So we can heal up. Get right back to, to full health here. I just have to get Rose's, um, Chaguna. Yeah, we'll give her the, the hit point ring. Ooh. We'll have to do that, because she really needs the hit points. She gets hit a lot, and she's really not that, um, Resilient to damage at this point. I mean, it's not like they gave us her armor. We got a lot of the others' armors. Uh, not hers. I missed. Oh well. Oops, that was me. That was me, I screwed that one up. Alright, Rose. Beautiful. I think it gets her on something that's got more, gets more points than 35. She doesn't have anything, though. You know, except for, like, her high-hit combos, which... Let me look. Yeah, because now she has Demon Dance. Yeah. I mean, more and more gives her more SP. Because 102. Doesn't do as much damage. But we have her SP faster. Let's do that. Yeah, I never said I was good at QTEs. It's actually what makes this game really hard for me. Is I just I'm not great at them. It's just it's a thing. Did I get good comment? Oh, crap. Get PT what? <laughs> Can we not type? Oh, I missed that. I forgot. Ti never timing. Yeah, I forgot that I changed the timing. Yeah. <laughs> Rose's uh, ring out. Damn it. I'm just gonna have more and more eyes because I want her to. Yes. 
max out. But you're doing faster. And now switch it back. to the end anyway. We just need to give her some help. That's what we need some help. Alright, so let's fix her addition to hard blade and then arms rose. Where is that one that gives her extra hit points? Avoid bewitchment, fear, dispiriting, stun, panic, poison. Raises maximum hit points 50%. Thank you. It's a miracle. There was an unattached fruit left over. Unhatched fruit left over. Is it a subspecies of a new insect? It was just born and it's coming after us. You will die? Um, I hope not. We'll see how this works out. See how many hit points it has. So that was 600. Heal Rose. You think? A statement. It's a very obvious statement. It's fine. Oh, I was just off. thousand points. Nah, you're fine. You're perfectly fine. We'll see how long it takes. So that's fifteen hundred points. 
fights have been going, it should be around 10,000 hit points. Why would I want to run? 2,000 hit points. I mean, come on. Why would I want to run from this fight? Big fights mean big hit points. Big experience points. the important part. More experience the better. Oh, that was garbage. That was garbage. Two, three. That was also garbage. Seven. Right. This should take us to good side. Three. Yep. That's three thousand hit points. I. So it's only got 6,000 hit points. We can live with that. I think we're gonna do that without losing our dragoons, but... We should be okay. This guy doesn't have any major... Um... You know, single death attack. That's what we've seen anyway. Now it's right. Wow! I got cheated. And then I got lucky. almost died. Almost. Yeah, I don't know how she dodged that. I'll take it though. Uh oh, here comes the death shot. Alright, it just evolved into whatever its next form is. The poopa. Oh sh shite. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be a three phase fight. surprised. I mean, it was a caterpillar. So, it, you know, evolving mid-fight from a uh, caterpillar to a pupa to a moth butterfly or something similar would not be surprising. Yeah, hydration. Wow, that was bad. Why? I just cannot hit this thing. Oh, 
Oh, and today's drink is soda. What is with this? There we go. There we go. Uh, Coke, actually. I got a Coke and then I got some water. Rose can actually hit the dumb thing. Alright, here we go. <sighs> now it's evolved into its... Humanoid Moth. Let's give you some more hit points. Just give me an excuse to heal. Yeah, not a... I'm not sure I like the art on this character. I mean, it's a great idea, it's a great concept. It is very pretty. I think the PlayStation 1 hardware just doesn't do it justice. Because it's so pixelated, because it's so small. Because the screen is so small. With this, you know, 420 resolution. Wide release of the Sega Genesis Mini does not have Lunar on it, but the Japanese version has Lunar 1 and 2. Now, I pre ordered both, and now I'm debating if I want to keep um, the English one. Cause the only reason I I pre-ordered both was so I could have the Lunar games on them. But I could dig a remake of this game. that thing in the head with your hammer. But yeah, it definitely needs a remake. And it'd be so cool if I ever gets one. But it won't. The odds of this getting a remake are so slim.
It has to do with the licensing. No, it's just the PlayStation 1 era, the 90s in general, was a horrible time for, for licensing. They hadn't... Oh my gosh! That hurt! Um, the, it wasn't until around 2004, 2005, that the, they standardized licensing and rights and redistribution and all of that. But, when you're, but anything before that, it's so funny because you have different companies that own the rights for licensing and distribution of a product in every region. So you'll have like one company owns the rights for say Legend of Dragoon in Japan. Another company owns it for the United States. A third will own it for Europe. A fourth may own it for the quote unquote global. So that like anybody who's not in those four three regions and ow, that wasn't too bad. And then you got the fist company, which is the publisher. And nobody can move unless the publisher says they can move. So what you end up with is you have all these mess, all these licensing issues with games and they can't do anything because of license paralysis. So it, it's a huge problem. That's why you'll, you'll see like a lot of games getting Japanese releases, re-releases and remakes, but they're not coming west. And it's because they can't get the American companies to get off their butts and be willing to um, put the small effort forward in order to do the remake. Because a lot of times all they need is translation. You know, like for example, for like this, this game I think was actually done in the U.S. and then translated to Japanese. But in the case of like Lunar, which was originally done in Japanese and translated to English, like a lot of games are. What? Huh? Oh? Um? Okay. But it's just, it's stupid. Nah, it's okay. I still have some um, angel feathers. And Rose can use it. I'll be fine. It's not that bad. I got prayers, so. And then she'll be up in like two seconds. Oh, sweet. Hit the person who's got hit points. See, don't just be up in two seconds. And she'll just heal. She might even heal for two rounds. She might have to. Oh, look at the hit points. 
next round and see what it looks like. But, but yeah, the, it, it, it's really bad. You know, it's the kind of thing that if, um, if I was like win the lottery, there were there are several games that I would. Um, spend those millions basically buying the right to remake and then hiring um, a good house to do the majority of the work. That's fine. I can work with this. I can work with this. Oh, who's gonna die now? Rose. Oh, I missed! Wow, she missed the death hit. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to definitely have to have her do her dragoon thing. I was going to anyway. But we're going to do the dragoon heal. Yeah, it was definitely lucky that it missed. lucky but it's not too bad so they didn't take any damage it was just that stupid status effect but it's red so it's almost done we're almost there that um, we didn't wipe on this because I really expected to do that I expected to wipe the way it was uh, hitting us but it's okay it's like we're gonna make it I 
is that she doesn't hit that hard? I mean, the way I have Marissa set up, she doesn't hit that hard, but she's going like twice as fast as everybody. So it's, you know, deceiving as to how much damage she's doing. Because she goes like twice as fast as everybody, but it's like half the damage. So, you know, she does the same amount of damage. Really? Ah! I've got experience though. Um, because it's a rain, so. I the body purifier. We really defeated it. Let's go. Uh, we are almost to the at the moon. And we run backwards. minute fight again. That's the last thing I want to do. Oh, it was a bad engine. Definitely was not. Paying attention. Save myself. What the heck? Honestly, kill the cute cat before it charms somebody. Dance of death? Are you kidding me? I 
Oh my god, I need more levels. And definitely that shop you're talking about. These monkeys. This fight is stupid. I give up, I'm not rezzing her. I'm not wasting what few I have. That stupid fight. Ugh. It's a it's that fight is like stupidly overpowered. compared to the rest of the fights of this class. It's a stupidly overpowered fight. This one's an easy fight. Sets is spreading poison all over the world. What's that one about the Santa? Uh, in order to stop the poison, we have to reach the core of the moon before it's too late. Unless Shana and and the core, as Rose says, are wedded. The God of Destruction won't get born, right? Is it a dilemma for us because we want to take Shana back? If we don't meet Shana and if we can't destroy, if we can destroy only the core of the moon, the world will be saved. But Sieg is here for sure with Shana. Uh, that is the only chance to save her. Uh, we will save, sh save both the world and Shana. Fate is not in the hands of the creator, it is in our hands. We won't let Soa decide the fate of the world. That goes for Shana's fate as well. We will decide our own fate. Thing is... Um... Based on... What we've seen so far... The moon that never sets... Wouldn't have been part of so as well. This would have been external. Because all of the... Yeah, well, Atlantic. Because all of the quote-unquote species were born from the tree. And this wasn't. It, it, this you know, came from space. So unless it was born, went to space, and then came back, which... Wouldn't even make sense in a Final Fantasy game. Uh, you know. It has been long, very. Uh, let's get going. You know, the... There's something else going on here, is that... 
Just as one point. Alright, hold on, I'll push to the next screen. Next screen button. And then it's shaking. Yeah. Don't tell me. The guy that destruction is about to be born. He can't be. The birth of the God of Destruction is our death. Yeah. Duh. That's right. We are still alive. Let's go. Let's stop my father. Okay. Is this a forest? <laughs> oh, I thought we stopped, stepped into the moon. But indeed, this tree is a true tree. Oh no, we were sent to the ground? No. Listen, it's the heartbeat of the Raj Embryo, the God of Destruction. An empty body that is a living corpse from which the soul was taken out by ancient winglets on the day it was conceived in the divine tree. We must be in the moon. Then no matter what it looks like, we gotta keep going. Okay. Frozen jet. You know, do I have like a yeah? Do that. That'll at least give her some hit points. I don't want to use the, the big heels. Look, it's a little baby dragon. Aren't you cute? Picking Amaru today. I swear. Everyone's picking Amaru today. It's fine. Not that big of a deal. We can live with it. There'll be a save point up here shortly. So, next room or two will be have well a save point. <laughs> it looks like a grass and so the moon is developing its own ecosystem. Which is interesting. This is uh, what's wrong. I know this place. Does it look like the forest of your own? Not only that, it is the forest of Billy Sinau, where I grew up. Okay, back. 
accent. So I went from here. Okay. There's something I have to check. Hold on. She's worse than Shauna. As I expected, this is the forest of my home. Why is this on the moon? Yes, dumb. This rose is going to kill you. Mother, where are you going? Oh. Uh, go home. Uh, you have a kid? Yes, apparently. Yeah. Mother, don't go. Father is calling you. Uh-huh. She's, she's as dumb as Shauna, I swear. What are you gonna do? Because I married that man, my life has been completely ruined. He hardly works and drinks all the time with the money I earn. I don't even have enough food and starving every day. I can't stand it anymore. Beautiful life must be waiting for me if I leave this forest. Yes, I can say farewell to this miserable life. Now let's go. Completely pointless scene. Except to kill Miranda. Is that a completely pointless scene except to try to kill Miranda? With what? The kid who has no hit points! She has no Dragoon, she has no hit points, she has... Garbage gear. I mean, really. No, I don't remember this fight. If I did, I'd still call it a stupid ass fight. Why did you abandon me? Uh, Randa had no choice. Shut up, Dad fell ill and became an orphan. I became an orphan. You'll never imagine how I lived since then. It hurts, whatever. This is one of those types of scenes. Oh, right. This is one of those types of scenes that they put into the game to justify the existence of all the characters. You've got seven main characters, most of which have had almost no story. You know, almost no story, no playtime. Uh, so this is the, their way of justifying um, the, all of the characters. It's not the only game that does it. Um, 
couple other games do it as well when they have a lot of characters. It's just, it's a waste. And not being able to use the Dragoon just makes it even harder. And completely pointless. Because, like, this character is by herself one of the most useless characters, if not the most useless character in the game. So, you're not leveling her up. You're not using her. And then you remove the one thing that makes her actually reasonable. That's why I visited him so many times. To take you with me. Every time he just kicked me out. Uh, my mother is talking about me. Uh huh. Uh, you have the same name as the goddess Malay. She is pure, loved by everybody. The name, I named you that because I was wishing for you. It sounds like lies. I mean, if you actually leveled everybody up and hit everybody at like 35 or whatever, these would be relatively easy fights. And if you had your Dragoon Spirits active, it'd be completely different. But not having the Dragoon Spirit just makes it even harder. Uh, do I forgive or not forgive? your heart. Oh look, she got 6,000 experience points. I was I entered the place in order to preach love and build the world where everybody could live happily, but my heart was filled with sorrow and hatred. Without knowing it, I was absorbed by fight in fighting in order to cease my loneliness. Okay. I didn't try to understand my mother's pain and agony, just create hatred at her many people I, I didn't deserve to be a sacred sister. What happened? She had come to Jesus moment. Uh, hey guys are really we're already, you know, she's fine. Uh, leave me alone. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Let's not waste time here. What is this? This is horrible. No. Downburst, really? Not really that useful. <sighs> Next. We gotta go four anyway. No one knows. We should have a safe one any time now. The little dragon. Hush, hush, hush. Die. Hush, hush. Hard 
Uh, I gotta go. Good luck, don't I? Yeah, I'll, I'll see you later. The. I don't expect to. We should have a save point soon. Yeah, they, they don't torture you that badly in this game. Unlike some like Final Fantasy games where they just make you spend like three hours with no save. This game doesn't do that, so. They put them pretty close together. So we'll see. Uh, there are people. A save point. Uh, what's going on? I told you to be a save point. Um, uh, why are there people on the moon? It's not, it's an illusion. Still don't know, but... What are you doing? You feel pain. It is certain it's not just an illusion. Uh, this world is reality. Indeed, I've never visited the moon before. I can't help but feel I know this place. People's faces close. Uh, it's not a mistake. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, this building is inserted to you. I have traveled all over the uh, Edna's, and they have typical Serdian faces. Look, the girl over there. Looks like Serdian. No, she is not. It can't be. Disappeared. Looks like that is reality here, too. So there's our save point. That's a good thing. It's always good to have save points. Uh, all right. We'll take a nap. This tune is... <sighs> okay. Weird. I am so... Buy something. Alright, so... Oops. Hold on. I need to sell something. Because we have... No need for that. again. One fog, two bridge shift, two fogs. Oh, so these people these downbursts. Actually, we'll be okay. Sure. 
So that's a clinic. I guess that works. Alright, so... We're doing good. I guess we're making good time. Um, a female is missing. Please look for her until we find her. This place is closed. Okay. So we have to go this way. Through the mirror. I understand that this place is not what it appears to be, but where are we now? In a world behind the wall. It seems as if the labyrinth of the moon is not refusing us. No, almost as if it's maybe inviting us? Oh, uh, Minotos. It must be... It seems this place belongs to them. I think they were the 99th species? Maybe they can tell us something about this place. The Psyche is creating this world. This time, it's whose heart, whose intended, whose intention. Is it you or you or maybe me? You don't see people who shouldn't see, who you shouldn't see. You see people you have to see. They've given us the ability to rest, heal. So I think what we're going to do here is... use this as a nice place to get some experience. With the inn right there, we can easily... Ouch. Rest, revive, and so on.
they got experience though. That is really good experience, that's for sure. And we know once we finish this, we're gonna go back to the inn anyway. You don't seem to be one of the Minotaurs. Look at her closely. It's the girl in the room we came from. Ah! She's the girl who disappeared into the wall, isn't she? Hi, what are you doing here? Oh no, she's gonna jump into the portal. The art. This girl doesn't know about you yet. What are you talking about? Uh, let me go now. She is Claire. She's inviting me. Sorry, but please wait for me here. Haskell was right. The girl was inviting Haskell, not you. We can only wait for him. So let's see how he does. Okay, but as with Miranda, what's going on with the moon? <laughs> You're all being tested. Claire, is it you, Claire? Uh, it's me, your father. Don't come here, I hate you. Aha! Uh -huh. Always, always strict discipline. What I can, what can I use such a thing for? Mm. Power to destroy the power to hurt people. I don't need such power. I strictly disciplined you since you were little. Uh, I only had you, I had to hand my art, this ancestral art, down to the next generation. It's not fair, I just want to sing songs, chit-chat with my friends, pick flowers, and fall in love. Our art was never meant to hurt people, it was, it is a martial art to give people life to people, please understand. I don't understand. And now we fight. And hopefully Haskell's got enough uh, strength behind him. Do you remember the first time we met Wills? Uh, you have my movements in a blink and went on the offensive with swiftness. It was an innate art. I don't think so. I am just a girl. I, I like the ones you can find anywhere. No, you can surpass me. Nobody has been charmed by the war god as much as you, your hidden power. It's not inside. It's hot inside my body. Dad, help me. Somebody's taking me. Okay, bye, Claire. Going. Take that, flurry of sticks. 
I mean, he's just gonna have to... I'm gonna have to heal him at least once. Like I do with Miranda. I missed. Problem is, not everybody. I I need to put everybody's best. Um, I hate you. Yeah, you did this to my body. It's your fault. No, it's impossible. The transmigration of the war god. Is she uh, demonized? Incredible. Nobody has ever reached that level except for except the founder. He's dead. What the black art of Nagarujuna for God's destruction. How did Claire learn? Okay, item. Use that. seem to hit the last attack. We'll see what it does. Something I can do. I am the war god. I persuade, preside over the art of war and back in death. I was your desire to awaken me. It was your desire to awaken me and I am the answer to your long quest. No, you are my Claire. You are not the war god. Leave the body of Claire. Told you. Total, total shit show. It's fine. Now it's a, it's the problem with games like this. We have seven characters and uh, They, they de-incentivize you to level up the characters. And then all of a sudden they expect you to have all of the characters leveled. It's one of those things that it's a... Uh, it's a really uh, poor design. Yeah, the... the if all of the characters gained equal experience, regardless of whether they were in the party, then everybody would be like 34, 35. And you'd be good. However, um, that's not the case.
You also don't get upgraded gear for half these characters. Actually, the Giganto ring might be a better idea for him. Double Punch is probably his best option. It's just, it's annoying when they do this. Anytime games do this, it's always annoying. Because they, um, just expect you to be able to deal with it and win instantly. It's like, no. Yeah, like everybody's like max level. Alright, we'll give it one more shot. And if we can't make it, we'll just end there for the night. And it's cool that they get the, you're finally getting the backstory on all the characters, but setting up these fights like this so that you basically have no choice but to lose is stupid. Because they've disabled the dragoons, so you don't have, um, the better offense and defense abilities. And then you have these stupid fights that, um, are way above most characters, uh, level. I know it was 35 to be one thing. But not everybody is. This one actually has more than the other one, and it's a lot easier to get. Considering we haven't been leveling anything up for that. So we'll definitely do this. It makes it so much easier. So now we're gonna switch back for half a second. Say she hates her dad. Go back to crying. And then go back to the war god and then do the the fancy move. And then we need to heal. So we'll use a breeze. we can get those. Ha, ha, 
Okay, we can get the fog. I still want to use the reins. If I can avoid it. So I want to avoid. Alright, so let's go ahead and use another heal. I use the one fog. Oh, for a second I thought she was going to use the stupid before god attack. Right after I healed. Something I can do. Uh, I am the god of war. Alright. This is where we died. I can hear it's the plain voice of Claire. Hang in there. He's got to live long enough to get through the story. That's the trick, it's just living long enough to get through the story. That's the stage problem, but you gotta do that. myself, I have to save my daughter, focus all of my body and soul into this, and kill the devil that possesses you. Is long enough to, to stop it. Yeah, it's just living long enough to get through the story. And it's scaled so that you can win, but. It's over. Uh, you also saw the past? Of course you did. Yes, but the past wasn't as bitter as I imagined. It seems everything, both the future and past, are filled in this moon. Uh, the future when the world will be destroyed and our past. Well, the other has who are made to see the past by the moon, right? Um, they see, as I told you, we are in reality. It's not an illusion. Maybe they can do it because they are the 108 species and gods. Uh, let's move on. We wasted time.
thing is... They're not in the past. You're not reliving the past. It's nothing like that. I'm gonna go back to the end. As much as I'd love to continue, I don't want to deal with the um. The next one without having upper heels. relive the past or anything or moving you literally into the past or anything that you know, outrageous they're just taking they're just taking your memories and then twisting them they're just twisting and perverting your memories that's all it's really that simple Now, it could be something along the lines of the moon is looking to see if the death of the world is necessary. Or to see if, you know, the species that currently inhabit um, have grown up enough. That they should survive. That's always a possibility, too. You know, there's all kinds of possibilities. But I'm still skeptical as to whether or not the moon really is so as well. I'm so skeptical as well that's actually so as well. Yeah, we can go back there. We can also go that way. So I don't know where the path went, but we'll check that out next week. We'll definitely check that out next week. But for now, let's see we're going to cut it. Um... I don't think anybody for dropping in. I don't think anybody's left in the chat. I don't think anybody's potted off for the night. So, I uh, look forward to seeing you in the next episode next time. Have a good night. <laughs>